I'm making chicken livers today and I have onions, mustard, scotch bonnet pepper, that's optional, bay leaf, garlic, these are the chicken livers, tomato puree, black pepper salt and oil. Now in boiling water you want to drop the pieces of the chicken liver. So in five, six minutes that's done. Now you just want to drain that. I've drained that off and I've put cold water in there and with a fork. I'm just going to fish them out and put them on a plate. Just cut that to what slices you want, sizes. Now I like when I get these soft bits because they all contribute to the texture and the taste of the finished sauce. Okay, now we're ready to begin. Just slice up your onions again however way you want. I've cut the squash bonnet peppers as well. I've added about half the plum tomatoes. You can use fresh tomatoes for this as well. I've added about a teaspoon of mustard, black pepper, about two thirds of a teaspoon. Okay, so that's the onions, plum tomatoes, mustard, black pepper, scotch bonnet, peppers, garlic, bay leaf. And we just need to put that in the frying pan now. So put oil in your pot and heat it up. That oil is hot, so I just put in the same. Once you put in the onions and the tomatoes, it soaks up all the oil, but don't let that worry you. Just fry it on high heat and eventually the oil will come out. So we're just frying the onions to get it translucent. Every time you mix, by the way, don't move away from the pot. You must stir every minute or so. And every time you stir, just poke in holes a minute and stir again. Okay, it's been 10 minutes now. You just want to turn the heat down, medium high. As you can see, the oil is coming up. I put in the tomato puree. So I'm just going to put in the salt and crumble in a Maggi cube. So now we can put in the chicken livers. So now you want to add in some liquid. Taste for your salt and just leave to simmer. Now you can just mix and you're waiting for it to go back to the sauce stage. I've just added one more Maggie to mine. So I've just turned up the heat now to the highest level because it's done really but I just want all the um, water to be sucked up to dry up and you just wait for the oil to come up all nicely. That's all dry now so I just turn it now down to the lowest heat level and that should just bring up the oil. Eat with French bread.